understand that this uh, room is being audio and video recorded? Sure. Okay. So I'm going to get, whoops, guess what I didn't bring in with me? Get my coat off. Mm -hmm. All right. You're not going to flip out on us or anything? You all right? Okay. Okay, I'm going to return here. Let's see if it make that <laughs> We're all kinds of stupid, yeah. Okay. Sorry for interrupting your commute this morning. Um, uh, before I say anything to you about what we stopped you for, I want to read you your rights and make sure you understand them, okay? Um, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can be used against you in a court of law. You have the right at this time to talk to a lawyer and to have him present with you while you're being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, one will be appointed to represent you before any questioning if you wish. You can decide at any time to exercise these rights and not answer any questions or make any statements. Do you understand those rights? Mm -hmm. uh, you and I spoke before, mm -hmm. and I think you recall that. Um, we spoke about Nikki Kuhnhausen, and uh, that's what we're here to talk to you about today. Okay. Um, when we spoke to you last time, I don't know if you recall the whole conversation, um, but she said that you, you, you met her earlier in the evening, met her downtown, um, hung out with her for a while, uh, drank some vodka together, you gave her a coat, and then she went home and then you met her again later. Does that ring a bell? Yeah. Okay. And what you told us at the time was that you, uh, you and Stan went back to Archer's house up there on 114th and you needed your van because you're going to go to work and Stan needed to take his van to his job, right? And at that time was when Nikki told you that uh, Nikki was really a he, mm -hmm. and that's when you're like, I'm so not, basically kicked her out I'm not into this, and kicked her out of the van, sent her on her way, okay? Um, then after that, you said that you went, see, so you said you were going to go to I went to work. Stan's, you were saying you were going to go to Stan's job site. No, I went to my other brother. Okay. Oh, your other brother. Is it Archer's job no. site? Ely. Ely. Okay. So you're going to go to his job site, but then you ended up, you're going to go to your job site, but you ended up just staying at his I job site. Yeah, I was confusing. I don't remember. Yeah. It sounded like you said that you were going to go to your job Next site. Way I went to work. Yeah, you went to work. Okay. Um, what got us here today is I want to talk to you about a, a trip that you took before you went to the job site. So before we before we go on, he's basically summarized everything that you guys talked about. Uh, mm -hmm. Is there anything about that? Is there anything that you want to revise before we continue on? I mean, you might have stopped by the gas station. Okay. I don't remember. So at, at the time that we talked, I didn't have uh, the benefit of all of your your phone records. Okay, but but now there's been some initial analysis done. Okay. So you left your phone left Archer's house and then went east out past Larch Mountain. What happened on that trip?
That trip took about an hour round trip from Archer's house, past Larch Mountain, up some logging roads, and then back again. You didn't just go to work, did you? I think I want to talk to work. It was a fuzzy day, but I don't want to be in a talk to work. Okay. All right. So I understand that you're being arrested today for the murder of Nikki Kudasa, whose remains have been discovered. Okay. Who was strangled to death. Okay. So we're going to put you back in handcuffs. All right. Stand up for me, please. I'm not going to ask you any additional questions because you invoked your right to legal counsel. Okay. And that is what's going to happen today. So. All right. Sit down. Sit down here. And we are going to finish doing some paperwork. Have some other things that need to do in maybe a little while. Okay. We may put you in a temporary holding cell for a bit. Get you some something to drink. You're probably going to be here for a little while and then you're going to be booked. All right? Um, the re the uh, I'm going to turn off this recording, but the room is going to remain audio and video recording.